I shagged a pipe fitter from Grimsby, I did. And his name was Rob, and the thing he kept it in his trousers he called a peculiar name. And it was a turn off whenever he came. Now I am no angel, me boys, as you know. And back in the day was a bit of a hoe, at least after fifty four litres of drink. That was mostly vodka and lager, I think. Now, girls, I'm not fussy that much to the size. I struggle most nights to just uncross my eyes. And shagging a pipe fitter's hardly a sin. And he was the last lad was left in the bin. We went to the castle for what I'll describe as most disappointing for when you imbibe. Far too much vodka, it's always the way. But also it was the way I heard him say. I call it my whelk, he said proudly, and I, not knowing my fish, asked him why the hell why. Go look in a book, he said, then you will see, and I think when you've done that you'll have to agree. By then I was starting to feel mildly sick. I'd had too much vodka, and his little prick was quite an appealing, and also the name was a bit of a turn-off whenever he came. Now I am no angel, my boys, it is true. On the way back to Grimsby, the point fitters flew. My knickers as some kind of trophy or flag on the front of the van to say they'd had a shag. The moral of this, girls and boys, is I think, be careful when randy and brimming with drink for someone you might think a bit of a dish might have a cock he names after a fish.